In the terminology of quantum field theory, a ghost, ghost field, or gauge ghost is an unphysical state in a gauge theory. Ghosts are necessary to keep gauge invariance in theories where the local fields exceed a number of physical degrees of freedom. For example in electrodynamics, in order to maintain manifest Lorentz invariance, one uses a four-component vector potential a x whereas the photon has only two polarizations. Thus, one needs a suitable mechanism in order to get rid of the unphysical degrees of freedom. Introducing fictitious fields, the ghosts, is one way of achieving this goal. Good ghosts Fadeyev-Popov ghosts Fadeyev-Popov ghosts are extraneous fields which are introduced to maintain the consistency of the path integral formulation. They are named after Ludwig Fadeyev and Viktor Popov. Fadeyev-Popov ghosts are sometimes referred to as good ghosts. Topic: <laughs> Goldstone bosons. Goldstone bosons are sometimes referred to as ghosts. Mainly, when speaking about the vanishing bosons of the spontaneous symmetry breaking of the electroweak symmetry through the Higgs mechanism. These good ghosts are artifacts of gauge fixing. The longitudinal polarization components of the W and Z bosons correspond to the Goldstone bosons of the spontaneously broken part of the electroweak symmetry SU U which, however, are not observable. Because this symmetry is gauged, the three would-be Goldstone bosons, or ghosts, are eaten by the three gauge bosons w plus or minus and z corresponding to the three broken generators this gives these three gauge bosons a mass and the associated necessary third polarization degree of freedom topic <laughs> <laughs> bad ghosts bad ghosts represent another more general meaning of the word ghost in theoretical physics, states of negative norm, or fields with the wrong sign of the kinetic term, such as Pauli Villas ghosts, whose existence allows the probabilities to be negative thus violating unitarity, ghost particles could obtain the symmetry or break it in gauge fields. The good ghost particles actually obtain the symmetry by unchanging the gauge fixing Lagrangian in a gauge transformation, while bad ghost particles break the symmetry by bringing in the non-abelian G matrix which does change the symmetry, and this was the main reason to introduce the gauge covariant and contravariant derivatives. <laughs> <laughs> ghost condensate A ghost condensate is a speculative proposal in which a ghost, an excitation of a field with a wrong sign of the kinetic term, acquires a vacuum expectation value. This phenomenon breaks Lorentz invariance spontaneously. Around the new vacuum state, all excitations have a positive norm, and therefore the probabilities are positive definite. We have a real scalar field phi with the following action S equals D four X A X two minus B X Display style s equals int d caret four x left x caret two b x right, where a and b are positive constants and x equals d e f one two eta mu 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 phi mu phi Display style x stackra mathrm def equals frac one two eta caret mu nu partial underscore mu phi partial underscore nu phi. Using the sign convention in the plus minus 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 metric signature, the theories of ghost condensate predict specific non-Gaussianities of the cosmic microwave background. These theories have been proposed by Nima Arkani Hamad, Marcus Luti, and others. Unfortunately, this theory allows for superluminal propagation of information in some cases and has no lower bound on its energy. This model doesn't admit a Hamiltonian formulation, the Legendre transform is multi valued because the momentum function isn't convex because it is a causal. Quantizing this theory leads to problems. <laughs> Landau ghost 
The Landau Pole is sometimes referred as the Landau Ghost. Named after Lev Landau, this ghost is an inconsistency in the renormalization procedure in which there is no asymptotic freedom at large energy scales. See also No ghost theorem, related to bad ghosts